Hey everyone, I'm Brandon Grazley, and this is Grazley Games. I play games, I open products, and when I open cards, I read every card in every pack. And I recently was able to pick up some Commander 2016 products at a pretty good discount at uh, Toys R Us uh, on my March break. And so I thought I'd open some of them for you today. Now this, uh, I've got Idris Maelstrom Wanderer, I think, or sorry, Wanderer, Maelstrom Wielder. I think I'm going to leave that one uh, for another time, but I'm going to open one of these two right now and I'm going to read through every card in the box. So which one should we start with? Any, mini money. Let's do Brea this time around. Uh, so let's get the box open here. Now I haven't actually played a game of Commander in person yet. I've played online before. But uh, I'm going to open two of these and I probably won't open the uh, Entropic Uprising deck at all for a while. I'm going to just start with these ones here. And uh, and see where we go from there. So inside the box, nothing in there. I've got the the oversized Brea card here. And just set that off to the side, I think. And then what do we get? Comes in a little box, good size box, really. A little booklet. Nope, more like a fold out thing explaining how Commander works. I imagine how Brea works and what the different commanders are in there. And then we have. Some cards, quick reference in the bottom that's pretty stuck. There we go. That looks like it. I guess I'll leave that there for now. This is not going to be a good storage box for cards afterwards. Unfortunately, it's not a very good size. It's also not super sturdy. Well, let's set that aside. It's nice to get such a big, thick pack of cards, though, isn't it? Well, and uh, if you haven't played Commander before, it's a... Uh, um, a singleton format, meaning each of the non-basic land cards is unique in the deck. They're all different. So there'll be a bunch of lands in here, but other than that, these cards are all different. Okay, let me adjust my, adjust my camera, and let me read through the cards for you. Okay, here we go. Let's, uh, let's get started. I'm going to maybe just shush them off to the side a little bit and take part of the list. You can see a preview over there. Okay, and we start off with the foil of Brea Ethereum Shaper. Akiri, Line Slinger, also a foil. And Bruce Tarl, Boorish Herder. So those three are all the, uh, oh, sorry, one more too. Silas Wren, Seeker Adept. Those are the foils that go along with Bray, and you can use any of those as your commander, and those are partners as well. Uh, i got to learn how that works exactly. So we have a Thopter token, bird token, bird, some more birds. Let's say some more Thopters. Okay, let me just count here. Okay, there we go. All right, now I'm excited about the mirrors that are in this deck. We have Mirror Retriever, Vidalcan Engineer, Ethereum Sculptor, Baleful Strix, very useful card, Trinket Mage, Etched Oracle, Sanctum Gargoyle, Everflowing Chalice, Skull Clamp, Sol Ring, Dispeller's Capsule, Executioner's Capsule, Cranial Plating, Felwar Stone, Icker Wellspring, Mycosynth Wellspring, Swiftfoot Boots, Thopter Foundry, Commander's Sphere, I'm going to keep going over here, I think I can hold this many comfortably now, Locks it on Warhammer, Grip of Phyresis, Ancient Excavation. We have Trial and Error. Is that called a Fuse card? I think that's right. Whip Flare. Parting Thoughts. Migratory Root. Armory Automaton. Magus of the Will. Fairy Artisans. I think this is a new card, if I remember hearing that correctly. Curse of Vengeance. Coastal Breach. Sidri, Galvanic Genius. That's a legendary creature as well and could be a commander. I think it makes a pretty cool commander. If I, I think I've heard I heard the episode where they uh, they made a Sidri deck on Commander's Brew. Uh, Ether Sworn Adjudicator. Interesting that that does not start with an A. Soul of New Phyrexia. Hellkite Tyrant. Now that's the one that, uh, yeah, if you have a lot of artifacts, you win. Sharum, the Hegemon. Uh, also a legendary creature. It's a Sphinx. Duretti, Scrap Savant, Planeswalker. Chief Engineer. Slobad, Goblin Tinkerer, legendary. Shimmer Mirror. 
I think that's the first one of those I've had. Master of Ethereum, not just in this deck, I mean, that I, I don't think I have that card otherwise. Hannah, Ship's Navigator, boy, there are a lot of legendaries in here. Solemn Simulacrum, Jorkadine, the Prevailer, Sphinx Summoner, Godo, Bandit Warlord, Mere Battlesphere, I don't have any of these either, that's cool. Hellkite Igniter, Filigree Angel, Bone Horde, Nevin, Nevinirils Disc, I don't know that card. That enters the battlefield tapped. You can pay one and tap it to destroy all artifacts, creatures, and enchantments. Well, that seems rash. Trading Post, Blink Moth Urn, Read the Runes, Trash for Treasure, Beacon of Unrest, Open the Vaults, Phyrexian Rebirth, Exotic Orchard. I think we opened that in Commander, or not Commander, a Conspiracy recently. Grave Upheaval, Planes, Planes, Planes. I think I know what's coming now. Bunch of Planes, Bunch of Islands, Some Swamps, Some Mountains. Okay, now we're past the basics. Arcane Sanctum, Ash Barrens, Azorius Chancery, Boros Garrison, Buried Ruin, Command Tower, the obligatory Command Tower, Crumbling ne Necropolis, Darksteel Citadel, Demir Aqueduct, Evolving Wilds, Mystic Monastery, Nomad Outpost, Rakdos Carnarium, Rupture Spire, Seat of the Synod, Terramorphic Expanse, and Transguild Promenade, Temple of the False God is our last card. So that is the Brea deck. So once again, we have a bunch of uh, legendary creatures in here that all support Brea that have the uh, partner mechanic. Okay, so that's the uh, first deck that I have for you today. And now let's open up uh, Kineos and Tiro of Miletus. Take the oversized card over there. We'll just get things open a little faster this time. I think. There we are. Okay, let's start off with our legendary commanders here. I think it's Kineos is how you say that. Antero of Miletus. Krom, Ludovic's Opus. Ludovic is the uh yeah, the Necro Alchemist. There he is. Ludovic Necro Alchemist. And Siddhar Kondo of Jamura. Okay. And we have a soldier, spirit token. Some more soldiers, a bird, and a beast. So those are our tokens. Let's set all that to the side. All right, I'm going to try to hold the whole stack of them here. We've got about, what, 96 cards here now? All right, starting with Veteran Explorer, Humble Defector, Orzov Advocist, Horizon Chimera, Soul Ring, Commander Sphere. You'll notice a bunch of these are the same because kind of every deck runs some of these. Assault Suit. Evolutionary Escalation. Ghostly Prison. Propaganda. Sphere of Safety. Swords to Plowshares. Arcane Denial. Beast Within. Sylvan Reclamation. Oops. Cultivate. Kadama's Reach. Migratory Root. Treacherous Terrain, Plains, we'll skip past those, Island, I guess we're going to have another batch of land in a minute, Selfless Squire, Prismatic Geoscope, Benefactor's Draft, Entrapment Maneuver, Seeds of Renewal, Zedru the Greathearted, Progenitor Mimic, Hushwing Griff, Chasm Skulker, Edric, Spymaster of Trest. 
Guafa Hazid, Profiteer. Selvala, Explorer Returned. Oops. A Crow and Horse. Windborn Muse. Psychosis Crawler. Kazul, Tyrant of the Cliffs. Realm Seekers. Oh, I'm having a trouble here. Rubble Hulk. Blazing Archon. Imperial Plate. Howling Mine. Temple Bell. Venser's Journal. Keening Stone. Oath of the Druids. Rites of Flourishing. Lurking Predators. Swansong. Oblation. Reigns of Power. Minds Aglow. Collective Voyage. Hoofprints of the Stag. Tempt with Discovery. Wave of Reckoning. Reverse the Sands. Blasphemous Act. Exotic Orchard. Forbidden Orchard. Homeward Path. Okay, now we have some islands here. Having a bit of trouble. Let me move some of these. And mountains. And forests. And our non-basic lands here. Oh, looks like I missed some. There we are. Ash Barrens. Azorius Chancery. Command Tower. Evolving Wilds. Frontier Bivouac. Gruel Turf. Is it Boiler Works? Jungle Shrine. Crosan Verge. Myriad Landscape. Mystic Monastery. Opal Palace. Rupture Spire. Seaside Citadel. Terramorphic Expanse. Transguild Promenade. Selesnia Sanctuary. And Hoofprints of the Stag. I'm not sure how I missed picking these up. And Collective Voyage. Did I say those ones already? Maybe I already had those sitting down there. Okay, well those are the cards in the uh, in the second deck. In the deck that is uh, uh, Kineo Sentiro of Miletus and the other uh, supporting partner commanders. Okay, so those are the decks. I'm going to sleeve these up here and we'll start to play these here at my house. So I hope you enjoyed the uh, reading through all the cards in these two packs. And uh, as I say, I've just got that one more the uh, Yidris deck that I haven't opened yet. So thanks very much. Uh, you can get a hold of me if you look down in the comments down below here. And of course, you remember, you can hit the like and subscribe buttons. I'd appreciate that very much. So thanks a lot, GG, and I'll talk to you soon.